breaking now from Raider Nation. Head coach John Gruden under fire today for comments he made in an email back in 2011. Good afternoon. Thanks so much for joining us at 4. I'm Kirsten Joyce. And I'm Christian Casares. Let's head right over to Ron Fertrell. He's following all the developments and he joins us live in studio for us. Ron, what's the update? Yeah, the email was from 10 years ago when Gruden was working for ESPN. He was writing to an executive with the Washington football team and he was complaining about DeMarcus Smith, who was black and who was head of the NFL Players Association at the time. And Gruden said, quote, Dumboris Smith has lips the size of Michelin tires, end quote. Gruden told the Wall Street Journal, quote, I was upset. I used a horrible way of explaining it. I don't think he's dumb. I don't think he's a liar. I don't have a racial bone in my body. And I've proven that for 58 years, end quote. Now, the NFL also issued a statement today. They said the email from John Gruden denigrating DeMaurice Smith is appalling, abhorrent, and wholly contrary to the NFL's values. We condemn the statement and regret any harm that its publications may inflict on Mr. Smith or anyone else, end quote. Now, I spoke with Frank Hawkins this afternoon. He's a former head of the NAACP here in the Valley and, of course, a former Raiders running back. He had harsh words for Gruden, the Raiders, and the NFL. A lot of us believe that that kind of discussion goes on in the NFL all the time. So if nobody has a comment, then that's typical status quo that they protect their own. Simple. Now, when you say you're not surprised, are you not surprised that Gruden would say that or not surprised that it would just be a statement from an NFL coach? I'm not surprised, number one, that Gruden said it. And number two, I'm not surprised that no one, including the NFL, wants to talk about it. Then the next question is, what is Mark Davis going to do about Gruden? What should, we'll tell, what should happen to John Gruden with this and with the Raiders? I'm not the owner, but if I could, if I was the owner, we wouldn't have that discussion because he wouldn't be the coach. There you go. Gruden met with the Raiders players this morning, letting them know the story and apologizing for it, and letting them know the story was going to come out. Now, this is all part of a, of a purging by the NFL, where they're going through 650,000 emails looking for w whatever they can find. The Raiders released a statement a short time ago that says that, quote, the, the email, quote, is disturbing and not what the Raiders stand for. We were first made aware of the email late yesterday by a reporter and are reviewing it along with other materials provided to us today by the NFL. We are addressing the matter with Coach Gruden and will have no further comment at this time. That statement from Mark Davis there. The Wall Street Journal did not say how they got the email, but nobody has denied that it is indeed authentic. We'll, of course, continue to follow this story.